Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Martian to Be. Today, we're diving deep into an another topic that's crucial for understanding the challenges of human space exploration, isolation and confinement. Expedition crews selected for space station missions undergo rigorous training and support to ensure they work together effectively during their long missions. Now, imagine the Moon or Mars mission crews, carefully chosen for even more extended journeys in isolated and confined environments. These crews will be international and multicultural, adding an extra layer of complexity to the mix. Cross-cultural sensitivity and team dynamics are paramount for mission success. Ensuring astronauts get quality sleep is crucial. Factors like altered circadian rhythms, different light cycles, a noisy environment, and the stress of isolation could affect their internal biological clocks. With heavy workloads and shifting schedules, fatigue management is a must. Crews on multi-year trips to Mars need activities to keep them engaged and prevent boredom. Effective communication and understanding among crew members are vital. Changes in morale and motivation can occur due to reduced stimulation, longing for loved ones, or feeling disconnected from family emergencies back on Earth. NASA's research with spaceflight analogs on Earth helps understand the behavioral and cognitive conditions that may develop during long missions. NASA employs various devices and technologies to counteract potential problems. From actigraphy for sleep assessment to LED lighting to align circadian rhythms, the agency is on the cutting edge. Astronauts maintain journals to vent frustrations and provide insights for researchers. Virtual reality is also being explored to simulate relaxing environments and improve crew morale. Engaging in meaningful activities like learning new skills or tending to a space garden can ward off depression and boost crew morale. NASA is studying Earth-based analogs to determine how much privacy and living space will be needed on longer missions in confined spacecraft. So, as we venture into the cosmos on these incredible long-duration missions, remember, it's not just about the stars and planets. It's about understanding and supporting the remarkable individuals who dare to explore the unknown. That's a wrap on today's deep dive into isolation and confinement and its impact on the human body. Stay tuned for more videos where we'll dive deeper into the world of space medicine, exploring the technologies, challenges, and incredible stories of those who venture into the cosmos. Thank you for joining us today on Martian to Be.
If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Feel free to share your thoughts and questions in the comments below, and we'll see you in the next video. Until next time, keep looking up at the stars and keep exploring.